memory glands. At the end of this module, you will be able to Describe the structure of a mammary gland. Mammary glands are a pair of external organs of the female. They are commonly called breasts. Their main function is to produce milk to nurture a baby. The mammary glands are modified sweat glands which remain undeveloped until puberty. They develop when progesterone and estrogen are secreted by the ovaries. The surface of a mammary gland has a projection called the nipple, which is surrounded by a circular pigmented area called the areola. The mammary glands are composed of glandular tissue and variable amounts of fat. This glandular tissue of each breast is divided into compartments called mammary lobes, ranging from 15 to 20. When a baby suckles, milk is secreted and passes through various cavities and ducts within each mammary gland. Let's take a detailed look at the path of milk within a mammary gland. Milk is secreted and stored in the clusters of alveoli within each mammary lobe. The secreted milk passes through the mammary tubules at the end of the alveoli. The tubules of each lobe come together to form the mammary ducts. The mammary ducts enlarge near the nipple to store milk. These enlarged mammary ducts are called mammary ampullae or lactiferous sinuses. These mammary ampullae supply milk to the numerous lactiferous ducts present in the nipple. Thus, the mammary glands of a female support the nurturing of the baby after its birth. 